underway here at the 2003 State Farm U.S. Figure Skating Championships. And on the ice right now, Rena Inouye and John Baldwin Jr. Veterans, no doubt, but uh, basically a new team in terms of pairs here on the scene. I think they're a very well-matched team. They both have nice flair to their skating on the ice. They're coached by Olympic bronze medalist Jill Watson, who has a lot of experience herself, and she told me there's no problem getting them to work. They come in and they push themselves. She doesn't have to really push them. And it's unfortunate because all week they've been skating very well, very solid on these jumps. Nice throw, triple south out. They've been together for a couple of seasons now. Last year they just missed making it to the podium, finishing fourth at the national championships. She's having a little bit of trouble on that spin right now. The sit spins could be lower. And I'd like to see the extensions on these spirals higher. Knees locked, toes pointed. Extension, nice long line, very smooth. Well, they got through it, but it looked as though that's all that happened was they got through it. She doubled the triple toe loop. They'll take a three-tenths deduction there, so that's unfortunate in the short program. They've got their own cheering section here, though, because John was born in Dallas, and his dad coached here. Coached figure skating for nine years back in the late 70s, early 80s. Rena Inouye and John Baldwin Jr. Actually double trouble here. She doubles her triple and then he steps out of his triple right here. So that in total will be four tenths. That's not the way you want to start the short program at the U.S. Championships. They got it right back on this throw triple Salkow. Good coverage across the ice and nice arms and expression coming out of that. And now they're marks as they sit in the kiss and cry area with their coach, Jill Watson, the 88 Olympic bronze medalist. First set, 4.4 up to 5.0. Well, it's got to be disappointing because they have worked so hard and they look so good in practice and to come out and do a performance like that, it's just so disappointing. And now the second set for presentation, 4.8 up to 5.4, so at least those, Peter, are higher. Yes, and that's where some of those first marks could have been had they not had the mistakes. So that in a way, in Baldwin, into second place, right behind Scott and Dulabon. Up next.